Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about how to add polynomials. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help to use Minute Math. We're given this problem here, find the sum, and we have two polynomials, 7y squared minus 2y plus 9, and 4y squared minus 8y minus 7. What I first want to do is identify our like terms. Notice the only variable we have here is y. That's a good starting point. Now notice I have a 7y squared. That's what I'm looking for. And I have a 4y squared here. So I'm going to put two lines to identify the y squared and two lines right here to identify that y squared. Now I have a 2y here and an 8y here as well. They are also like terms and it's only two really like the one power. So let's put one line underneath it. And lastly, we just have 9 and 7. No variable, no lines. So now we're going to reorder this to put our like terms next to each other. 7y squared and 4y squared. Let's add that up. 7y squared plus a 4y squared. Now we're going to deal with the, well, just the y's. Minus a 2y here, and its like term is a minus an 8y right there. Lastly, we have our well, just normal numbers. We have a plus 9 and a minus 7. So now we've rearranged this to have our like terms next to each other. So now let's simplify. 4y squared, sorry, 7y squared plus a 4y squared comes out to be 11y squared. Now I have a minus 2y and a minus 8y. The way I like to write this, I like to write them as plus a negative. It makes it a little easier to see. Minus 2y, or you know, plus a negative 2y plus a negative 8y is a negative 10y, or minus a 10y. Bring it back to subtraction. Lastly, 9 minus 7 is a 2. We add a 2, and there we have it. We simplified our polynomial, we added them together, and we got 11y squared minus 10y plus 2. I hope this video was helpful for you, and if it was, make sure you like this video and subscribe to our YouTube channel. This helps us take more of these free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching.